now we have this lovely patient here who has, what do you think this is? Tell me your diagnosis. Do you think there's a fungus? Do you think this nail has been damaged? What do you guys uh, think about it? So we're going to perform a nail surgery removal. We've got our forceps, which we're not going to use just right now. I've got my elevator, which I'm going to use to loosen up everything. And then I think those two are the things I'm going to be using itself. How are you? How are you feeling? All good. Yeah. How was the How was the injection? Yeah. It wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Yeah, that's good. You had to do a little bit more because uh, obviously <laughs> it wasn't numb. The injection is usually the worst part. So I'm just loosening everything up right now. That's great. This is very stubborn. And as it goes up, it just, it just gets layered on top yeah. of each other. Yeah. That's the thing about these type of nails is that they tend to do that. They usually pops up very, very easily. Just like that. See some hair. Ah, got some hair here. Nice. You've got your kind of infected tissue there. Got your round tall nail. And then a bit attached to the nail bed. But what we can see from the nail bit is that it's small, just like I said. And there's a bit of damage. So what I'm gonna do is can I have a 15 blade, please? Thank you. So what I'm gonna do is just clean this off flat a little bit. But the nail is off. I'm just cleaning everything. Can I have some? So I'm just using a 15 blade just to kind of clean off the nail bed a little bit. Just a little bit, not too much. Is she done or is she? No. Oh, I'm just cleaning that. So I'm cutting away the. Just all the, the kind of debris and the dead yeah. tissue. But I'm not, not um, causing too much damage. Okay. Just really moving, just superficially. Discoloration is beneath the nail, which is now gone, or is that yeah. discoloration? Is it still quite... the discoloration is all gone from okay. the nail, okay. and now it's just cleaning the nail bed, just removing as much of the debris and scar tissue, okay. and any residual kind of nail that might be lingering around. Feeling okay? All good. Yeah. Yeah. I'm really happy with that. So all of that, so what we're going to do is press it. It's going to continue to cut off time. Return of blood. Amazing. Yep. So we try. Just gonna put a battleground catastat on there. And then 
just press it Jeez. Beautiful. so I'll show you the nail in a minute so that are you relieved that it's gone yeah yeah you've had it for a while haven't you and then just to because it bleeds we're just gonna have a really thick kind of dressing just to support that foot And it shouldn't really bleed through, but if it does, don't worry too much about that. You want to elevate okay. your foot, okay. you want to have compression. So, so I, I have it, I keep it elevated uh, tonight while I'm sleeping? Yeah, and you want to, every, when you're sleeping, you could just have it like norm, normal. Okay. Um, but when you get home now, you have it elevated and then just move it down every 15 minutes to prevent okay. it from uh, developing uh, DVTs and things like that. Okay. Um, it, should be, it should be fine. And then we're just going to take it to secure it. Put the bandages and um, the ones that you mentioned on the aftercare. Do you know so. why? Do you know why that is? <laughs> we all know why. Your mother is great. <laughs> You're just like, I just got one of those. I took one of these. They're over there. <laughs> Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. <laughs> Oh, you've got all of it. Hi, thank you. Let me see. So I've got a set of it. Yeah, yeah that's good. So I've gone first, yeah. and then you put the meatball around it. And yeah. It the so on Thursday, we'll change it to uh, inner dean dressing, mm -hmm. and then you'll change it on, on you'll change it on, 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 well, depends on what it looks like. Either you leave it on for a couple of days, or you change it every single day. Okay. Um, oh, so I, I see you again on Thursday? Yeah, on okay. Thursday, okay. yeah. Um, so you don't do anything with this foot. You just, Okay, I'll just leave it as it is. Yeah. Okay. That explains what it does, the limbo. Yeah, the limbo. Yeah, which I use. So. Yeah. And you don't want to, for the first week, you don't want to get it wet anyway. Okay. Hence the limbo. Okay. 